replacing the cameras. The Fairphone 5 is our most sustainable smartphone yet. It's made with fair and recycled materials and it's built to last. The really special part? It's yours to open, yours to repair and yours to keep. So you can easily repair it yourself with a standard screwdriver. In this video, we'll guide you through the simple steps to take out and replace all three cameras. You can now replace separate cameras within the Fairphone 5's premium triple camera system. All three are premium 50 megapixel cameras, and should you ever need to replace the wide, ultra wide, or the selfie lens, we've got you covered with this quick and easy tutorial. Preparations. But first, let's make sure you and your Fairphone are ready to go. Here's a short checklist before we start. Make sure your Fairphone's battery is charged. Most batteries don't come with a full charge fresh out of the box. Find an even, level and clean surface to work on with a good light source so you don't miss any of the action. We recommend to keep a few handy items at hand to make your life easier. A cloth to clean the surfaces of your phone. Two small containers to divide and keep all the small screws in place. A credit card, guitar pick or other similar plastic card to help with removing modules and parts. Your trusty Phillips 00 screwdriver, like this one from our collaboration with iFixit. A word of caution, please don't use any metal objects other than the screwdriver when working on the phone. Your own hands or the plastic card or pick will get the job done and protect the internal parts. As there are several different steps involved in disassembling and reassembling your fair phone, it helps to watch the video in full to get the bigger picture before following the steps and getting to work on your phone. Got all that? Okay, here we go. Since we're taking out the battery for this one, Make sure your Fairphone is turned off by pressing the power button on the side of the phone together with the volume up button and selecting power off on your screen. Depending on your settings, you can alternatively hold the power button and select power off as well. Now we'll start by popping off the back cover by separating it from the aluminium frame. With the screen facing down, you'll see a little notch on the bottom right side of the phone. You'll hear a nice click once it disconnects. Make sure to start there and work your way around until the back cover comes all the way off. Got it? Cool! Now, simply lift out the battery from the little triangle at the bottom. It should come right out. From here on, you'll need your Phillips 00 screwdriver. The top unit is held in place by these seven silver screws. Unscrew them, lefty loosey, righty tidy, and make sure to keep them close and safely stashed. You'll need them again later. Next, you'll want to gently lift the connector cover in the bottom left corner of the top unit by hand. This will reveal a board to board or B2B connector that you can also disconnect using a credit card or pick. With all seven screws loose, the connector cover removed and the B2B connector disconnected, you can now take out the top unit. You'll need to lift it out from the bottom Now check this out. You've uncovered the engine room of the Fairphone 5's 50 megapixel magic. All three cameras are connected with B2B connectors. The selfie camera B2B connector sits at the center at the top. Disconnect it using your pick or credit card. Now you can just lift the selfie camera right out. Please try to avoid touching the lenses as you do so. The ultra-wide camera B2B connector is the one on the top left, next to the selfie cam B2B. Disconnect it in the same way as before and gently lift out the ultra-wide lens. Two down, one to go. The main camera sits just below the ultra-wide lens. Disconnect the B2B connector and lift out the main lens. Each of the cameras can just be inserted the same way you've taken them out. Make sure to reconnect the B2B connector for each one you've swapped and you're good to go for the final steps. 
Reinsert the top unit. Reconnect the B2B connector and the connector cover. Now screw the seven silver screws back in. Put your battery back in and click the back cover into place again. Turn on your Fairphone 5 by pressing the power button on the side of your phone. We recommend firing up the camera app to check if everything runs as it should. Quick check of all the lenses. Snap, snap and snap. Looking good. Voila. That's all. Congrats on your DIY camera replacement.